Good morning, Colts. My name is Mackenzie. And I'm Kelly. Welcome back to Northside News. Today is Monday, September 11th, 2023. It's been 22 years since the 9-11 terrorist attacks made by Al-Qaeda. During the attack, four planes were hijacked, one hit the Pentagon, and two of them hit the Twin Towers. The fourth was going to hit the White House, but failed due to the heroic passengers stopping the hijackers. Sadly, 2,977 innocent people lost their lives due to the attacks. Even though it's been 22 years since the attacks, we have not forgotten about the attacks or the victims of the attack. Speaking of remembering, remember that progress reports come out this Friday, so make sure you're getting your grades up. Oh yeah, thanks for reminding me. I heard one of our own students achieve something incredible recently. What's up with that, Mackenzie? Well, Addison Blackwell has been working closely with the UF Chemical Engineering Program on a research project. After she submitted her project and board, she was selected to present her board at the American Institute of Chemical Engineering Conference in Orlando, along with some other chemical engineer majors from UF. She will be the only high school student presenting at this conference. Seniors, you want to apply to college. Do you know how to do it? Do you need help with the college process? We can help. We are having two informational sessions next week just for you. After school on Monday at 3.30, meet Mr. Galvin and Ms. Spencer in the Media Center or meet them before school at 8 a.m. This Thursday, September 14th, all interested seniors are welcome. On September 18th, tutoring will become available to any and all students that need it. If you are in need of any academic assistance or support, we encourage you to take advantage of this opportunity. Forms can be found in guidance, the front office, as well as Mr. Corbett's room, Building 24, Room 109. Tutoring times on Monday and Thursday at 8 to 9 a.m., Tuesday and Thursday from 3.45 to 5.15. Tutoring will take place in Building 1, Lab 47. When I went outside today, it reminded me that the weather has been kind of off lately. What's up with ASAF? Nigga, Mackenzie, it's going to be a high of 91 with a low of 72. It's going to be hot today. Glad you got to the studio. Thank you, ASAF. I can't wait for the weather to cool down for a bit. When is our next football game, Daniel? Our next football game is this Friday against the Santa Fe Raiders. And for any girls I think about getting stronger, the girl weightlifting team wants you. If you need more information, contact Coach Carter or Ms. Morrison. Also, the swim team has a meet against Lake Ware this Thursday after school. That's it with sports. Back to Kelly in the studio. Thank you, Daniel. I hope everyone who's interested in these sports got the information they need. I sure hope so. Our blood drive last week was pretty successful. Haley, what's going on with our other clubs? The blood drive was very successful. Thank you, everyone who donated. Gaming Tabletop Club will be meeting after school today and every Monday in Miss Murray's room, building 24, room 209. Art Club will also start meeting after school on Mondays in Miss Sed's room, building 1, room 31, starting Monday, September 18th, which is next Monday. The dance team will also be meeting this Monday for practice. It is $165 to get in, but payment plans are available. Back to you in the studio. Thank you, Haley. Today's quote is, you define your own life. Don't let someone else write your story. And with that, that's a wrap of the morning news. But before we go, let's make sure we're abiding by our school slogan. Please remember to always do what's right, do your best, and treat, treat others the way you want to be treated. treated. My name is Mackenzie. And I'm Kelly. Have, Have a great, great day. day. Go, go Colts! Colts.